Bitcoin has been banned. Stay tuned for the update. Ah! It's true. Bitcoin has been banned from the second largest market in the world. Where is that? Nigeria. I guess you didn't know that Nigeria, yes, Nigeria in Africa is the second largest market trading Bitcoin. No longer. It is now officially banned by the Nigerian Central Bank. Is this the first to ban Bitcoin? No. Watch this. So while the United States of America, Australia, Canada, and the European Union, consisting of 27 countries, have accepted its usage by working to prevent or reduce the use of digital currencies for illegal transactions, cryptocurrencies still remain banned in these countries. China, Russia, Vietnam, Bolivia, Colombia, and Ecuador. But even though all this is happening, there seems to be no stopping this runaway train. What do you think? But before you think, smash that like button. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Let me know you like this information because I got a lot more coming. Like I said, Bitcoin, Dogecoin, and all these cryptocurrencies, it's like a runaway train. And anyone trying to stop this thing is dead on the tracks, including your boy right here. Most of you may not know, I'm anti-government. I'm anti-establishment. If I could, I'll burn the whole thing down. Yes, I'm crazy. Seriously, guys, I love this type of thing. At the same time, I have my feet planted in reality. I know that the powers that be have you, have me, have Bitcoin under the boot, and any time can smash us like a dirty little bug. So with that knowledge, I tread lightly, and that has cost me, yes, has cost me some money. At the same time, those around me, including my own family, have profited from Bitcoin. And the reason is, I've been helping them. It's like a two-headed monster. One head says, bye, 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 bye. But the other head says, calm, 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 calm down, slow, 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 slow down. And you have to have that balance to capture some of the upside at the same time, protect our nest egg and don't risk too much. So for everyone who wants to invest in Bitcoin, who wants to invest in Dogecoin, who wants to invest in cryptocurrencies, I say, go for it. But at the same time, lace up those shoes, lace up those sneakers, get ready to run. Because at any time now, when the market crashes, everything's going to crash, including stocks, gold, and every single coin you could imagine will crash, including real estate too. There's never been a point in time in the markets where everyone is all in. Not only are they all in with the money they have, they've been borrowing left and right to put into this market. And it's just being pumped and pumped and pumped. But guess what? There's no more money left. No more money left. Believe it or not, there's no more money left. Because the ones who are all in, all, all, in, all in, and the ones who can't invest, they can't because they're facing eviction. They lost their job. They lost their savings. Or like the millions of businesses, they are either dead or about to die. That's why right now in our banking system, there's more and more savings, more money than ever before because people are afraid putting away money, not to invest, but they're protecting themselves because they know something very, very bad could happen to their lives. So as we sit atop historic highs, ask yourself, do you think the best investors in the world, the smart money, want to invest when the market is its absolute peak, its high? No, of course not. But this is a time where FOMO, fear of missing out, is absolutely rampant and the hysteria is nearly at its peak. When that happens, the big players are gonna cash out and they're gonna do it just like this. You, me, everyone else is gonna be like, oh, 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 what the hell just happened? And they'll be like, pew, on their private jet, out of here. Hey guys, I want you to make money. I wanna make money. At the same time, we have to play this game with a level head. So again, like I said, go ahead and invest, go ahead and do your thing, but keep your sneakers on because the shit is about to hit the fan anytime now. I don't want you hurt 
because there's going to be more opportunities to make money even when the market collapses than any time in history. Let's be patient and let's get ready to take care of these historic, massive, unprecedented opportunities when the market crashes. Together, let's go!